Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. My name is Riley. If you're new here, I'm a licensed cosmetologist in the state of California. And today I'm gonna be doing a Redken Shades EQ toner haul. I did one of these videos a couple weeks ago, just super quick in my car and a lot of people liked it. So today I'm gonna be doing another one. I just went to Salon Centric the other day, got a few little things and I'm gonna be showing them to you guys, showing you why I get them, what I use them for and why I like them. A lot of these things are my stock ups, my repeats. I got two of pretty much everything because these are my things that I use a lot. A lot of them are for like shadow roots, root melts, low lights. I do a lot of that stuff lately, so I've been stocking up on a lot of toners. Okay, so I'm just gonna start pulling them out of the bag saying, oh. So the first one is 8N. 8N is obviously a level eight. It's a natural, very neutral. And I like to use the 8N for shadow root. This one is definitely a staple of mine, especially when people want a little bit of a root, but they don't want to be too dark. That's pretty much when I use the level eight instead of the level seven. Okay, the next one is 9V. And this of course is the nine violet. It's a platinum ice is what they call it. This one is a staple forever. I constantly have to have like four of these on hand. This one is really good for someone that wants to be ashy obviously the background tone is purple so it cancels out any yellow this one is a good one always a staple i got another 8n like i said perfect for shadow rooting i got a 10n and i have been loving the 10n recently i like to use it on someone who wants to stay really bright and this one actually has the bonder inside so i'm excited to use this one because i've been using the regular 10n and i've been loving it so Trying the one with the bonder inside, it's gonna be really exciting. I got a 9GI and this one is called Hamptons. It's the perfect like sheer golden shade. It's still very ashy. I would say it's more on the ashy side, but has like a sheer tint of gold over it. So it doesn't dole out your blonde. Sometimes I'll put like a 10GI in someone who wants to be really bright. That way it doesn't completely make them golden, but it doesn't make them too ashy where they're really dull and dark. So love my 9GI. And then I got a 9NB. This one is a red violet, so it actually has a little bit of red in there. It's perfect for a filler if you ever need to like fill a level 9 to a level 7. I like to use the 7NB. It has a little bit of red in it, so it's going to fill, but then it also has the violet, so it's not going to make them completely red. Love that little trick. But this is the 9NB, so if someone wants to be really beigey or a little bit more golden, this one is going to be perfect because like I said, it has the red in it. That one's really good for beigey blondes. I got another 9GI. I was out of this for a a while so I got a few to stock up and then I got a 10p the 10p is perfect for those clients that want to be super bright and ashy I like the 9p but it does get really dark so that's when the 10p comes into play it is amazing then I got an 8gi I love the 8gi and I was out of this for a long time and I literally did not know what to use instead of the 8gi I love to use the 8gi with the 9nb for beige blondes the 8 is gonna kind of make it a little bit darker so it's not like a super bright blonde like this but the GI is going to keep it on the ashy side while the NV is going to warm it up a little bit creating the perfect beige. I got another 9V like I said that one is really popular with me. Here is another a GI one of my favorites honestly another 9MB another 9V and another 10P and that is the end of my Shades EQ stock up. So those are my Shades EQ stock up toners by the way if the angle is different someone just walked in and I was filming myself so that's really embarrassing <laughs> those are what i use on an everyday basis and every weekly basis and those are some of my favorite toners of all time if you guys have any questions about redken shades or you want to share some of your favorite toner formulations go ahead and comment them down below i hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video don't forget to follow me on instagram and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys